Hey guys, so I thought I'd do a quick video on how to change the skin on Plex. It's not as straightforward in Plex as it is in XBMC. XBMC you simply install them from a repository. So why do I use Plex? Well the advantages over XBMC are tenfold. It's easy to use, it's quick to set up, it's one central media source for all of the devices in the house, transcoding to iPads, Androids, etc. Which is something with XBMC I've always struggled with. Skinning is something that Plex seems to have dismissed and it is the only downfall to what I've found to be a perfect piece of software. People like to customize their media centers, it's as simple as that. So Plex developers, if you're watching this, please update it. But in the meantime, here's how it's done. So when you launch your Plex home theater, so when you go into your preferences, you go down to advanced, you have the skin option there and obviously there is only the one there so how do we add one so all we do I've actually downloaded one already which is here media stream so I'm going to extract the files now for Plex to understand that it, it needs to have the skin name at the beginning so it's skin dot and then whatever your skin is called. So just check that you've actually got your files in there because sometimes they extract into that folder and it doesn't always pick it up. So the skin files are held in your roaming profile, which is obviously in your users folder under your user that you're logged in as and then it's a hidden folder which is percent now this has to be capitals app data percent and then bracket and this brings up your roaming folder find your plex home theater folder which is there and it's under add-ons so all we do is move files into there That's it. So when we actually go back into Plex, and go back to the preferences, go down to advanced, Plex, and there it is, media stream. Once you change that, and there it is, everything is done. It hasn't actually picked anything up yet. All kids movies. There you go. And then that's how we add a new view. And you can change the layouts. Panel stream. Is your your metadata and backgrounds and so on. And it's as simple as that. Does the same for music. It's a much nicer display, I think, to the um, default Plex skin. So, thanks for watching.